Hi friends, now we're going to talk about something about layouts. Okay, so if I go to this transaction FPL5, okay, I always put FPL1 in, so we just put FPL5 in, okay, for customer balance. And here I execute, okay. Now, here you will see there is something called layout, okay, the layouts. So, if you want to know all the layouts of a particular transaction code, how will you know? So here you can see all these uh, these layouts has been created. So how will I know for multiple transaction code what are the different layout that has been created and who has changed it and all those things? Okay. So how can you get those information? So at the end of the day, in SAP everything is a table entry because it's a uh, because it's a technology. Okay. So now here I go to system status and I select the program R fight man okay the moment I go here and then I'll go to this table okay I go to SC16N and this is the table this is a view and here I'll put this program and I execute here I will get everything that is available in what that has been created okay so if I go here I'll just check cross check uh, just execute mm -hmm. and here if I go layout this will contain everything so let me see whether we have Z test somewhere so Z test will be there see and also here lots of times you can find out who has created it and who has last changed it lots of times you know they play with the global layout someone messes up the global layout it's always advisable to create your own layout and then change it so here you get all this information which is very useful now this was fbl5 now i want to go and check what is there in fbl1 okay so the same thing i will do fbl1 and i just take this off and i'll execute and here you can see if I go and try to select the layout, as I have a bunch of layout. Now, how will I find all the layout? So, if I have a requirement to get all the layout that has that is there for multiple, all the FBL one n, FBL five n, FBL three n, what I can just do is here, I can just populate here map and I'll execute. And I'll get everything. I get everything, and here you can see the change, changed on, last changed on, and all those things. So this is very, very helpful. So that's it. Stay tuned to my SAP channel and happy SAP learning. And if you like it or share it, uh, subscribe to the channel and have a great day.